And welcome back. You know, if you suffer with sinus, then you know the symptoms. They can leave you fatigued, congested, you've got headaches. It's just the worst. Well, this morning, there's a way to solve the problem and start feeling better. We've got Dr. Vincent Onrubia. He's a director at American Sinus Institute. Doctor, how are you doing? I'm doing great. How are you doing? I am do I'm doing fantastic. And I'm going to tell you what we're talking about today. I have had this done. And doctor, it was one of the best things I ever did. And of course, what we're talking about is balloon sinuplasty. Correct. What exactly is it? How does it work? Balloon sinuplasty is a procedure we do here in San Antonio and Houston and in the Valley that allows us to go into the nose, open the nose using small balloons by compressing tissue to create more space in your nose so that you can breathe better, function better, snore less, sleep with your spouse, mm -hmm. et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Mm -hmm. So it's something that's very effective done in the office and allows you back to work as you know the following day often people are back in action. Uh, I, you know I was really, I'm going to be honest, I was very surprised on how quick the procedure was, how there was no pain involved for me and how much it helped. I mean it just, uh, before I was a mess because I had sniffles all the time, uh, snored a lot, I, this really helped that. I haven't had, I'm not kidding, I haven't had, I haven't had one sniffle since I had the procedure my, and my results may be a little bit different than most but it has been wonders for me. Your procedure was about a year ago and it's typical that if you get more room in your nose even though you may be having an allergic issue you don't notice it because you have more space in your nose mm -hmm. and with more space in the nose you can accommodate your allergies much much better. Here in San Antonio with all this rain the cedar season is going to be big. Mm -hmm. It's better to have more room, stay away from over-the-counter medications, stay away from medications in general which mm -hmm. aren't good for you in various ways. I haven't had any Afrin or any of that kind of stuff. Who, who's a good candidate, doctor? Patients that are going to the pharmacy, taking over-the-counter anti-allergy medications, often patients that have headaches, patients that have problems with their ears, pressure, drainage, patients that snore, patients that don't sleep properly. So a ride, there's a wide variety of symptoms. All of those were me, basically. <laughs> and those symptoms, people don't often connect to their sinuses, but that's something that we're trying to get the word out in San Antonio. We've been here for three, three years and we are now the leading provider of balloon sinuplasty in the country. Well, I can understand why you did a fantastic job. Uh, and I almost hate asking this question. Why should somebody pick you guys? They pick us because we are the ones with the most experience. We have done the most in the country mm -hmm. and we use the technique, the Honrubia technique, which is a technique that combines anesthesia with the balloon sinuplasty that allows the patient to have a painless procedure versus doing it while you're awake like a dentist, which is what most people are doing here in San Antonio, mm -hmm. which it works, but it's not comfortable. So if you could do something with anesthesia, why not do it with anesthesia? Yeah, why, I mean, why do it awake? Exactly. I, when we did it, that, that was the best way to do it, you know, because I didn't, I didn't have any recollection. Before, as far as I knew, it was over just like that. It's a short anesthetic. The procedures take about 15 to 20 minutes, so the patients receive very little anesthesia and return to work either that day or the following day with an open, clean sinus. How long do most results last? How long until you have to do maybe another procedure? The patients with a low allergy load that have allergy testing that shows that they don't have many allergies, it is a permanent fix. Permanent, because it changes the bony structure of your sinuses. Mm -hmm. Patients with a high allergy load need to address their allergy problems. Mm -hmm. And that's something that's easy to do once you have a much more open nose. Mm -hmm. You know, lots of times patients want to spray stuff in their nose, they can't even get the spray in their nose because their nose is so closed, it doesn't work perfect. at all. Well, I'm gonna tell you, thank you, doctor. You thank help, you. You help me, you and they can help you as well. Give them a call, the American Sinus Institute. They're over on Day Zavala, and you can call them at 210 Balloon, or you can go to americansinus.com. Thank you again so much, doctor.